So let's now show you how Apple Play works. So what I need first of all is my wire. This wire needs to really ideally be the authentic wire. If not, please try and make sure that it transfers data as well as charges your phone. So we plug the USB N in to the car. And make sure that's all plugged in. And then literally what I do is I plug the other end into my phone. And try and do this one-handed. E, that's an accomplishment. It's done. So now I can click on Apple Play as you can see it comes straight up straight away hit on that. I can undo my phone so it lets me in and it's taking me straight into my music. So I apologise if you haven't got the same taste as me, but it shows you straight into my music. So we'll start with music first of all. I can hit on the music button now on the screen, it shows me the song I'm playing. I can hit on library, I can go back and it shows me my playlists. I can do it as individual songs as well. Uh, so I've got everything there for me as well, which I think is really cool. Uh, I can then go hit on phone. It'll show me my phone as well. It'll bring up my contacts, who I've called recently, your voicemail, it also does the keypad as well. But what I like about this is if I use this button here, I can do voice recognition. So I can hit that button and go phone book, phone mum. And it'll then ring mum for me. So that's pretty cool. Or any other family member. Um, so as long as they're in my phone, I can then use that button to give someone a call. I quite like the maps as well, so I can click on the map button and I can use the map here. Now, a lot of people say, yeah, but you've got Sar Saracen comes with SatNav. Yeah, it does, but I actually prefer using, say, Google Maps or iMaps, because I actually find that to give you live traffic reports, which the car doesn't. So live traffic reports is a good idea. So, to give you an example, what I can do now as well is, if I haven't got an idea of the postcode of where I'm going, I can hit this button. Destination Dominion Theatre. I found one option. Dominion Theatre on Tottenham Court Road in London. Is that the one you're looking for? Yes. Here is the map. So then it shows me the routes. And then all I do is hit go. Starting route to Dominion Theatre. And it does it all for me. How Proceed to Lordship on? Road. Then turn left. How cool is that? It even tells me if I left now what time it would take for me to when I would arrive and how long it would take and how many miles it is. I can hit on this button here, I can end route, I can even talk to it and tell it to end the route as well if I wanted to. Um, I can click on this button here, it will then bring up to the whole screen. So if I hit the Sangyong button, it will then just basically get me back to the Sangyong unit. But I'm going to try and stay on this one for the time being. Like I said, we showed you the phone, we showed you music, we showed you the, the maps. I can hit on messages and now it basically shows up all my messages. Uh, I can even get it so it can read out a text message to me uh, and I can also then respond and tell it to send the text message as well, which I really enjoy. I think it's a really good part of the system. Uh, and then literally what else can I do? I can then fold the screen. I can do things like Teams. So if you've got like uh, all your contacts in your Teams contacts, you can click on that and use them and speak to them. One sec. So you can do that, so that's pretty good. I've got Waze there, I can use that as well. I've got Zap Map for, you know, for the um, finding the charging points for charging station. I can even use WhatsApp through this system as well. Um, so it is so clever, it does so much. It just opens up the world to you as you're driving along. You can do so much more. Um, so, so yeah, I think it's a great, great product and I think everyone needs to use it. Uh, with Android Auto, you do have to do something slightly different. You do have to download the Android Auto app uh, and then uh, sync it or everything like that, then use, the, again, the authentic wire to be able to get it to work. But hopefully that gives you just a quick insight of what you can do with the system and how you do it. Thank you very much. Bye.